there, but it's still winds will remain gusty through the early tier of the overnight, relaxing through the overnight into tomorrow. So goodbye to the 60s, which by the way, the record today is 64 from 1984. I think we may have tied it while the official climatology report coming up during Fox 8 News at 5, but it's going to get colder like in a snap. 30s and 40s are going to rule the eight day. Quiet start to Christmas week, and we have your Christmas Eve forecast showing up now in your eight day forecast. Current temps. 62 in Cleveland, 58 Lorraine. Obviously, rain has cooled you down, and the cooler is starting to work in near Toledo and Finley. On the way, 60 in Akron, Canton, 60 in Youngstown. And again, we have those winds that are very active right now. Let's see the current sustained versus the gust. So sustained 15 to 25, gusting up to 36 at Lakefront, 31 Lorraine, and a 34 Akron, Canton. Weather alerts, just to show you quickly, wind advisory until 6 o'clock this evening, less than two hours away. The winds will remain gusty just the next several hours and really. And really fade overnight tonight. Tomorrow morning, much more relaxed wind flow. But that's after this cold air just races in. 62 Cleveland, 56 Toledo, 41 Chicago, and whoa, 20 degrees in Minneapolis. We're not going that low, but we're going to get chillier definitely in this eight day forecast. So temperatures going down. We're going to have another pretty chilly overnight. Temperatures probably right around 30 or so. And then tomorrow, only about 40 to low 40s. These showers are going to exit here even between 6 and about 8 p.m. for the majority of the area. Already moving out of northwest Ohio, the northwestern quadrant is dry as that front has swept by. Cold air on, in the process of working in. And then otherwise, as you go through tonight, there will be enough clear pockets where a lot of radiational cooling will take place. Starting off with sunshine on Friday, ending up towards sunset with a lot of clouds around. No raindrops at that point, but as the rain moves in Friday evening and Friday night, there could be a little bit of a mix going on. So beware if you have some Friday evening plans into the overnight, mainly rain shower Saturday. I still threw in a chance of a little mixing here and there north at times, but mainly on Saturday, it's a rain event. So looking at preset future cast here from the rain that's going to be occurring tomorrow night into Saturday, a good half an inch of rain in general is expected across the region. Breaking it down through the next five days, so tomorrow's a sunny start, cloudy finish. Then the rain and a little mixing north occurring Friday night into Saturday. Saturday, mainly rain, but a chilly one with temperatures only around the low 40s. Sunday, some lake effect spotty snow showers. Not really going to add to anything either, by the way. Nice quiet start, but pretty chilly Monday to Tuesday for Christmas week. So around 30 tonight, evening showers exit, getting colder, gusty early, then winds really begin to die down. Sunny morning, cloudy evening, high temps tomorrow, low 40s. Eight day forecast.